Hi everyone, how are you doing? Kamal here and I welcome you all to the first hands-on videos tutorial of Windows 10. In this video, we will tell you how to multitask like a champion on Windows 10. Windows 10 brings enhanced multitasking and whether you are in a desk, whether you are using it in desktop mode or you are using it in tablet mode, in both the modes you can use the enhanced multitasking. So let's see how it uh, works. The first thing that you should know is uh, Windows 10 allows you to create new virtual desktops. So not only desktops, uh, even if you have many apps open, all you can see by using this task view button. So if you use this task view button, you can see these apps are open for this desktop one. And similarly, if you go to desktop two, you can see these two apps are open. So uh, one more interesting or important thing that you should know is uh, how to set the multitasking, the way you want to do the multitasking or use it. For that, you can go to settings, you can go to system, and you can go to multitasking. So you have here the features are, uh, I mean, all the way how you can actually arrange windows automatically by dragging them to sides or corner of the screen. When I snap then uh, more than one window automatically adjust the size of the windows. And when I snap a window show that what I can snap next to it. And it also says that you can actually manage that on the taskbar what you want to see. So you want to see one desktop or only the desktop that I, you are using. As we have put it as all desktop, you can see that we were able to see two desktops there. Even pressing Alt plus Tab, you can sh uh, see that which windows are, I mean, all the windows that are open there. So the, here is the place where you can actually uh, control the multitasking. So I'll again show the navigation. You go to settings, system, and multitasking. And here you can do all the settings. So now we'll see how these settings actually work. Okay, so uh, coming to how we can play with one of the windows. So uh, if, if you're that kind of person who want to use the keyboard to play with the windows, you can press the windows key and you can just use all the four navigation buttons like this to snap the window to one of the corners. And as we have seen, as soon as you snap a window to a corner using the windows and the navigation buttons, here you will see that uh, it will suggest that you can snap these windows also with this. So if I can press on that, so see, it, it automatically uh, snaps it as soon as you uh, press on it, which is very cool actually. Now, uh, you may have seen the settings that if you uh, just uh, hold the window and if you if you like uh, just leave it here on the top it will automatically maximize but if you drag hold and drag it to corners it will just go and snap itself so as soon as you take it to the top it maximizes but if you snap to the corner it goes and uh, it, it automatically resizes and gets snapped so pretty cool this is how you manage it and again coming to desktop 1, desktop 2 and you can see all the windows that, uh, I mean all the application windows which are open for desktop 1 and again similarly if you go to desktop 2 you can see that there are two uh, apps which are open here. So this is how you handle the multitasking in case of uh, desktop mode, it's very cool you can use both the ways, either you can uh, you know multitask by, by choosing one of the application and you can as I, as I have shown you can just you know leave it on the top to maximize or put it to the corner or sides to resize it and snap or you if you are a keyboard keyboard uh, uh, crazy kind of person you can just hold on any of the app you can hold the window key and then you can navigate So this is how it works. So you can use all the four keys. It if you uh, press the key, I mean if you hold the window key and if you press down, then it disappears. Then if, if you press the up key, it will appear. You again press it, it maximizes. You can snap to left. You can take it to right. So pretty uh, good actually. You can just use your keyboard to do that. 
Okay, now coming to desktop mode, uh, from desktop mode to tablet mode, let's see how it works in tablet mode. So, uh, how will we, I mean, how, how can we quickly enter to tablet mode? You can just go to the action center and pick the tablet mode here. And as soon as you have entered the tablet mode, you can see the task view button. Uh, it, it, it grows, a, I mean, a bit in size. It becomes prominent here. So this is how it looks like now. Now, uh, all uh, I mean, all the all the apps that were open in any of the desktop would be able to be, you know, it is visible here, quite visible here. And here you don't have any control. So whatever you try to do, you would not be able to do it in tablet mode because you have automatically, uh, I mean, the, the window will automatically resize it. But here I would like to show you a very uh, cool, uh, I mean, uh, I mean how it handles. So if, if you go to any of the app, so let's say we have Okay, I think I will have to show it here. So let's go to a store. Okay, from a store, if we click on any of the links, okay, we have to click on a link which takes it uh, takes us out of this window. Then I will show it in just a sec. Okay. Yes, so that's what I was trying to show. So as soon as you uh, click on any of the links and you open a new window, it will automatically open next to the window I was working, uh, you were working and both the windows get resized and snapped next to each other. So that's how, that's uh, how, I mean, it is and how cool it, uh, in, in what cool way it works on, uh, in case of tablet mode that you can understand here. So hope you have liked our uh, tutorial on multitasking. Stay tuned for more on uh, Windows 10 how-tos and tutorials. Thanks for watching.